Hello everybody, I'm in the Little Wood, also known as Martin, and welcome back to Metopia. Today, we are inside one of the inns at the end of a recent run against the, what was it called? The Rocky Iron Man, I think it was his name. And we got this thing out of it, a very rare item called a Chock Rock. So, it gives defense, and I'm wondering who we should give this defense to. Again, I keep throwing items at Mercy, and she never likes any of it. But I feel like it would be nice to, for her to have some good defense where her HP is low. I might regret this, but I'm going to try it. Please like it. Oh, come on. I mean, it did level her up by one, so I guess it was decent, but still. Uh, we need to find out who else likes the uh, the, can the the cloudy floss. So I'm going to give some to Luffy and see how he fares with it. No, he doesn't like candy floss. Interesting. Love God loves it, but... That's not what matters right now. Let's have a little look in the shop then. What is everybody selling and buying? So we can up our damage by five, which I've really wanted to do because Mercy has been outdoing us on the melee front, which should not happen. Uh, we could get you a new microphone. That would also take you up by five. Mm, oh, there's so many things that I want to buy. I think I want to upgrade Love God. Just simply because I have more control over him. Um, so it would be nice to have better damage on there. And he did actually buy the right weapon, which is nice. I wonder if there's a chance that Love God can not buy the right buy the right weapon. You know what I mean? I wonder how that would play out if um, if it did. Seeing as you are the player. Alright, well, seeing as we're out of money, we've only got like 30G left over. Um, let's get ourselves back out into the world. And we're going to go over to Greenhorn and go give Iron Man his face back. There he goes. All the way into Greenhorn. Let's go have a little chin mag with him. So I'm guessing we can't enter the next area, like where that guy was, you know, Bowser Jr., until we've actually gone ahead and secured every face. So we've got that face just there, and I think just this one as well. So if there is, there's only one more face to secure, so it's pretty obvious where it is, isn't it? It's through that weird well area where we had those characters that made us cry. <laughs> I love that his eyes are obviously designed to be closed at all times, but... On the rare occasion they open, it just looks so stupid. Ah, <laughs> oh, got my face back. I got mixed up with a badon. You're not a bad sort, I suppose. Fine, you deserve at least something. What you got for me, mate? 10G. Oh, mate, you are generous as anything. He's got that massive industry. His suit costs probably 10 mil. Probably more. And he gives us 10G. It, it, it wasn't even worth saving his face. Let's be honest. It wasn't even worth it. Let's see if there's any more pieces of the map that aren't filled out just yet. Because I'm worried that I'm still going to be a little bit underleveled to tackle those crying things again. We could go could do a quick run through there before I head into it. I think that might be our safest bet. Just so then we've definitely done everything at least once. Plus, there could be treasure waiting for us down there. Or enemies on the road to it. What we got? Oh yeah, alright. Just a couple of moths. Uh, I'm just going to go for a straight-up attack, I reckon. I love how preemptive Mercy is as well. You just don't expect it from her kind of character. What we got? Oh, nice. one shot in all over. Let's get through the animation screen. Butterfly honey in the bag. 10G as well. So we got more from a wild encounter than we did a being whose life we rescued. Like, just seems silly to me. Anyway, let's carry on. Are we at the crossroads just yet? Yeah, we are. All right, let's go down. Oh, that was why before, wasn't it? Yeah, tough path and easy path. I wonder if it's just the troll. This is the real tough way. I think last time it was a case that we had to fight four goblins, wasn't it? This time, only two. But I bet you have to do it numerous times rather than all at once. I bet it's two separate encounters. Just to give you a window of time where you can go grab yourself like a HP banana or something. Everyone can have a little chow now. Whoa, what you got? Weak point found. Nice, dude. We're up to 50 faces rescued. GG. Gotta go fast. Gotta go slow. Gotta kill enemies. Gotta go... What have you found? Potion. Oh, yeah. Do it. Just drink it. What kind of buff is it gonna give you? It smells kind of funny. Drink it anyway. Go on. We like to drink with Love God because Love God is our mate. When we drink with Love God, he gets himself poisoned. <laughs> that was not going the way I expected it to. Uh, can I eat something? Or should I wait for Mercy to give me a heal? Guess what I could do? I could put down my booby trap, couldn't I? And then that would rescue me from getting one-shotted. Oh, dear. Or I could just crank in with the uh, the HP sprinkles at the start. Let's do that. Because I doubt we're going to need them anywhere else. There you go. Good job. They'll replenish when we get to the, uh, the inn. Uh, no, not auto battle. Let's go for a regular old attack. That's it. That's all it took. 
We're good. We're fine. Probably like two XP from that. Let's have a look. Yep. <laughs> good guess. All right. I've got so much butterfly honey though, dude. I'm going to be able to feed people well. Uh oh. Oh, it is treasure. Nice. Let's open it. We haven't had a booby trap treasure one just yet. We got a very rare version of the goblin ham. To my recollection, I believe Love God is the only character that actually likes goblin ham at the moment. I don't know if we've actually given any to Guy just yet. Ooh, we got a new gift. What is it? <gasps> yes, dude. From 20 to 25, that is awesome. <laughs> the gratitude of the people has awakened a new power within you. Truly, you are a beacon of hope for all of Metopia. All right, you may continue smiting monsters. Oh, and you'll get your next perk once you reach 100 people. Chop, chop. <laughs> Thanks, goddess. Ooh, those two are getting close to leveling up together. Old guy and Luffy. Ooh, there's a conversation going on there as well. Let's have a little chinwag. You didn't sleep much last night. Oh, poor love god. Did you have nightmares? Oh, mercy sleep talks. <laughs> I guess it's better than snoring. You kept saying, are you joking? Oh, that's quite a leap. Tell you what, one more stay in, and I reckon those two will max out on that on that, that, on, that, on, that, that on that level. What we got next then? So we got the goblin ham, regular goblin ham, and some MP. So it looks like Love God loves the stuff. What about if I was to give him the big one? Let's have a look. So he likes that one. So there's no way he couldn't like this one, right? Let's see. My attack is 18. His is only 12. Let's try it. If you don't like this, I'll be well annoyed. Yeah, he is. Ding. He's up to 13 now. No, 12. 12, my bad. All right, butterfly honey. So, you like it. Don't know about the rest of the guys. I almost just want to give it all to Mercy, but I don't know. I don't really need much mana myself. He goes through mana quite quickly. Let's try it just to see if he likes the food. No, not very tasty for him. All right, let's definitely give the last one to Mercy then. Get her leveled up a little bit. And then we got a final goblin ham who we can give to Love God. Because why not? He's been sitting there patiently the whole time. Man, we have got no money. What would we have wanted to have bought, though? Oh, it's still those that same bit of armor, isn't it? It only upgrades you by three, though. Banana for you, banana for you, and then a sword that only goes up by two as well. So it does feel like we're hitting, like, that sort of plateau point, which is nice, because it means that we might be nearing the end of the demo. So let's get ourselves out. Should we try and go for those guys? You know the guys I'm talking about? I think we should. So I don't think there are any other roads leading to anywhere else. There's literally just Bowser Jr. and that's your lot. Yeah, let's do it. Let's give it a try. I feel relatively prepared for it, so let's see how this plays out. I wonder if there's going to be like a big boss at the end of this cavern. So not just one with like a regular old face on, but like a, a proper like instance boss. Because this feels almost like a dungeon, doesn't it? This little section. Come on. Where are those crying people? Let's see how this plays out. Yep, here they are, all three of them. I almost want to start with Love God attacking, just to see if he can get them in first, because he can damage all three of them. Nice, nine, six, and four. Nice. So that's 16 damage done on her so far. That's what, 20 damage done? These guys got a lot of health. Now she's got the crocodile tears going on. Yes, Love God. Go on, dude. 27 damage done to them. Still not dead. Love God just isn't bothered about any of them, is he? Finish him off. Go on. They've got tons of health, dude. I mean, we've taken one down now with relative ease, so hopefully this is going to continue onward. Nice. Oh, they dinged in battle. That's even better. Is that level four for those two? Yeah, it is. Maybe sort of likes. <laughs> Concern. So you can console a friend after they've taken a hit. Where does it hurt? So I wonder what that does. I wonder if that gives him like a little bit of health back. Oh no, Love God. Luffy's like, don't cry, Love God. Look what I can do. Nice, keep that going. So we need to move somebody back into a safe spot, don't we? All right, so you're crying as well. It's probably more important for us to have Love God back rather than the other two, so let's give this a try. Everybody's good on the health front at the moment. Hey, he's back to normal. Gonna pull you out of the safe spot when we get a chance. And the new ability as well. Brings everyone back to normal. What? Oh my god, Mercy, yes. That's like the best thing she could have learned. I'll be completely honest. Was not expecting that. Feels a little bit OP, to be honest. So as long as she isn't crying, this is good. 53 faces rescued. Oh, she's looking elsewhere. 
first assist. Oh, I see. And we tell him to not take the damage. Ah, ha, ha. I like it. Oh, man. Let's go. So I wonder, I'm trying to remember at the minute, is it Luffy and Guy are in the same room together at the hotel at the moment? I'm trying to remember. I'm just wondering if like the relationships in battle are only happening between the characters that are sharing a room currently. I don't think that's the case. Nice, she's done, she's finished. That is quite the contrast to the last encounter that we had with those three. Wonder how many more of them there's gonna be. Anybody leveling up? Wow, 48 experience. And we've got two lots of Banshee tiers as well. Let's keep on going. Don't trip me up. You'll be okay, Mercy. Don't worry about it. Ooh, a fork in the road. So we can either go upwards or to the right. I'm going to go up to start with. Because if we can bail out after getting that chest. And then we can come into this whole area again. That might be good. Let's see. Uh-oh, she's got the hiccups. Someone scare her. Love God, make a jump. <laughs> I'm gonna scare her. Did that work? Oh, she only lost one health though, that's fine. Why are the hiccups gone? Is the question. That will apparently never get the answer to. <laughs> Why not? Oh, here we go. This is likely the only encounter between us and the chest. At least that's my guess. Oh no. These two have got a healer this time. Just gonna start with their big group attack then. I'm guessing that the middle one will definitely be the lowest health, so we're gonna go for it. First energetic quirk. Ah. <laughs> Look at Luffy. You can do it, Mercy. Yeah. Oh, recovered mana as well. Nice. Not quite down on the uh, the clouds yet. Who's going to get hit? Nope. Love God don't care. Try again. Oh. I honestly didn't think she was going to look there. It didn't seem like she really turned the body at all. Go on then. What's Man Wow going to do? Ah, nice. They're going to have to skip a turn. So that does mean we could throw Mercy into the safe spot. Just to get her healed up during this turn. There we go. Good job. Right, let's do this thing. Come on. And attack. Nice. Going to show off. Middle one should go. Yep. See you later, mate. Now it's just basically a 4v2 situation. It's a lot of health to get through there, though. Stay on it with the attacks. Almost gone. Yep. Is she stopped crying yet? No, she's still crying in the back. And she's recovered. Cool. I'm going to hit safe spot and get her pulled back out. To potentially get a turn in before the enemy does. Nope. All right. Who's crying this time? She's oh, come on. She's just come out of there. Damn it. That's fine. We'll just stay on it. She might snap out of it soon. Here we go. Maybe like two more attacks and it's done. Oh, she still actually does damage to them. That's nice. Forgot about that. Team Love God wins. How much experience that time? Another 48? Oh, no, only 38. Oh, cloudy floss that basically no one likes. Wait, wasn't there supposed to be a chest there? I thought we were supposed to get to a chest before we got to an inn. Someone in the team has reached relationship level four with another team member. <gasps> oh, and I've got hiccups. No, Mercy, why? <gasps> oh. <gasps> oh, I can't get rid of... <gasps> oh, I can't get rid of them. Oh, I'm going to pass out if I hold my breath any longer. Long breath out. And I think I am oh, good. Okay, let's carry on as we were. Oh, no. Oh, no, no it's not gone. <laughs> Who's going to level four? Oh, no, it's only to level two. Really? Only level two? Oh, hiccups still not gone. All right, whilst I'm trying to get rid of the hiccups, let's find out what these two are up to. Really? They leveled up again? That's level 5 now. Wow. It seems to be like snowballing. Shower a friend with compliments. See? I knew you could beat it. Wow. Oh, I still take ups. Uh, uh. Alright, so I reckon the Banshee tears can only be for Mercy. Oh, the Mercy. I've still got the hiccups. I can't get rid of them. I'm sorry, everybody. We're just going to have to deal with them. How do you not like that? Are you kidding me? The only person who uh, on our team who might like it then is this guy. Oh, I can't speak. 
Please, just stop. All right, then. So what does everybody want to buy right now? We have got Guy looking for some MP suites. We've got Luffy looking for the armor upgrade. I'm a little bit short on dollar there, though. We have got Chick here. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Sorry, I just I read the title at the bottom, and then I looked up. What is that? No way am I putting Luffy in that. Uh, not Love God in that outfit. No chance. Oh, I see. So he's actually giving us a direct route to the chest. I wonder if it will just be a straight in and grab it. Or will it send us on a journey? Yeah, it looks like it might send us on a journey. I guess it's similar to the uh, the northern part of the last one. Oh, no, wait. Hold on. 280 G. Yeah. Should we go back to the inn on the overworld then? Oh, actually, unless we have to fight an enemy before we get to the end of this. Then we can actually buy somebody. So, oh, big chest. It's going to have an enemy in for sure. No, it's not. The polka dot threads. Is that for Guy? I thought it might be. Whoa, dude. Six upgrade. Second hand defense up by six. Dude, I really like him in this outfit as well. Although I wish the red was a little bit darker. It's a little bit like pastel isn't it? Um, I'll tell you what, I'll have him in red. And then I'll change his head appearance, I reckon. So if I bring up the menu now, uh, where is it? Uh, stuff. And I reckon Guy can have his hat removed. Where is it? Uh, edit appearance. Hat. Nada. There you go. I'm happy for him to be like that for now. I don't mind the polka dot shirt so much. All right. Let's carry on rocking and rolling then. What we found? The inn. Yay. All right. So we've actually got some money now. So we can buy somebody something. Oh, you can let to three different types of threads. The preferred clothing of the male pop star. Good job. All right. So what's going on right now? Anybody friends? Ah, Guy and Luffy. You want to ask if I want to continue playing? Uh, yes, I do. <laughs> right, so nobody's chatting away right now. What are the relationships like between the characters? So you and Luffy are acquainted now to level two. Luffy and him are acquainted. Mercy isn't acquainted with um, Guy whatsoever. So let's swap those guys out. And we can continue the relationship between Love God and Luffy. Because Mercy sort of like slipped past us, hasn't she? She suddenly becomes super strong. That is a significant leap. 19 attack. I'm not wearing the chick gear. You can sod off. Not wearing that sword. It's only two. Yeah, let's buy Guy the microphone. Let's see if he actually buys it, though. Please, please, please. Yes, he did. Maybe it's quite an infrequent occurrence that somebody doesn't buy the right item. Nice. Good stuff. Uh, do I keep him with that microphone or do I change him out? Hmm, I think I might change him out. I like the regular one. I like the sort of traditional, like, black and grey, uh, crossy pattern one. Where is it? Weapon appearance. Debut mic. Yeah. All right, I think it's time for us to set on out then. Look at that, five and five. That's awesome. At least we've got a lot of crossover happening now, which is good. So I reckon that there's probably going to be another one or two p positions to travel here. I reckon we're going to go all the way to the right, all the way to the top, and then all the way to the right to what will potentially be like a final enemy. So hopefully we can get to this crossroad without any interruptions. We do have our upgraded sprinkles now, though, which is nice. So if we need any additional heals beyond Mercy's Cure... We might be okay. We might be able to survive an encounter like this old one at the beginning. Uh, let's just stay on the attack this time around. More damage to do as well. What we got? Wow, 10 damage. But that's the first time I've seen uh, Love God do double digits. Go on, guy. Yes, that's going to stop them. Now, will that stop them from this turn? Oh, I hope it does. That means none of them will cry. Oh, yes. Let's see what happens. You're not quite down yet. Let's just stick with it. Go on, Mercy. Big old attack for 15. It's gone. Wow. The turns are getting shorter and shorter and shorter. I love it. No no extra boost there, though. That's okay. I reckon middle's probably going to be the next one to go down. Oh, nice. Mercy caught her back. What? It wasn't noticed in time. But is she going to give us a res? Let's have a look. Are you okay? Is it basically just going to reverse all the damage? No, it didn't. Just did the relationship. Okay, I mean, I guess it's fine for it not always to be combat related. Nice. There goes the middle one. One more left to kill. She's healing herself. How rude. Does she not see how low my health is right now? I'm going to use the sprinkles just in case. I'm worried that they're just going to pull a move out of the bag that we're not expecting. There you go. That'll do. Right, let's get into the attack then. Ready for it? Oh, not sprinkles again. I like that every time you go to the sprinkles, they have like, this little team huddle as they come back out of it. Eight damage, not quite. Guy's probably going to finish it. Yep, there it is. 60 rescued. Dude, we're going to be at 100 in no time. It just feels like we're getting loads per episode.
Whoa, everybody's getting to level five except for Mercy. That's a shame. All right, we've learned Pilfer attempts to steal snacks from enemies. Doesn't always work. <laughs> I love the steal move in most RPGs. Then we also got the Proud Protector. Focus on defense to absorb the damage aimed at the team. That would have been good for our um, Rocky Tony Stark, wouldn't it? We, we can hurt the enemy by singing badly. Your friends suffer a bit too, though. Oh, no. I mean, we don't really get to choose when those abilities pop off, so... Prepare your earphones, everybody. Anybody who's got those in, I'll warn you if I get a chance. Right, so we're not going to go up. We're going to go to the right this time and see where that leads us to. Let's go for the sprint. So, Mercy, do you have a war cry using battle? I can't imagine she would do. She doesn't strike me as a war cry type. Oh, guys, sad. I should have just pressed yes. I should just press yes on all of these, because otherwise I'm going to miss out on an opportunity. We've, I don't think we've yet to encounter a situation where we've lost relationship, have we? Oh my god. How many of you? You guys make up an entire face. <laughs> Alright, let's go for it. It's going to hit all of them. Wow, okay. So, 10 damage was enough to take out the last guy. 7 wasn't enough to take out the second, so... They're sitting on 8 or 9 health at the moment. That's totally fine. Then you're all just going to get little bits of damage in. Love God will definitely finish him next time if it doesn't happen. Nope, she took the damage anyway. Never mind. What we got? Oh, yeah, of course. I forgot. Guy's also a widespread attack. I feel like we've got a really nice mix of a team here, you know? We've got focused attack, brute ones, and then we've also got Guy who can do a little bit of buffing, and we've got Mercy who can do a little bit of healing. I sort of accidentally chose a really nice mixture of people. Yeah, look at that. One more attack to finish us off then. That's going to be Love God putting him in the bag. Did that count? I, I wasn't paying attention, but did that count as individual faces? It did, didn't it, right? Because we had 60 in the last one. Oh, yeah! Mercy to level 5. Good job. 70G as well. Mmm, not bad. So how long is this path going to be? Or is it now going to turn upward? I wonder if it's going to turn upward to follow the path that we had on, like, the world map. Oh, my word. That's a lot of enemies. I'm going to start off by trying to get some attacks in. Try and take out that healer, because they're going to be the problem for us. Nice, good. Healer down. The rest should be easy. Oh, were you okay, Mercy? Oh, there's a little bit of blushing and the relationship going up there. They are getting on incredibly well. Nice. Look at that one-shot kill. Tell you what, if I want to grind to that level 100, oh, I say level 100, 100 rescued, this is totally the place I should be coming to. Six weak enemies in one go is always going to be a nice shout. Uh-oh, crocodile tears for who? For Guy. That's all right. Guy can cry it out. Just got one enemy left now, yeah. Go on, Luffy. Finish it off. No, Mercy's going for it. She done did it. Up to 73 already. That's ridiculous. Cloudy floss, banshee tears, and 100 gold. Nice. Right, let's see what's at the end of here. The map isn't moving just yet. That makes you think... That something's coming up. Because normally you get to the halfway across the screen and then it all the whole map moves away from you, doesn't it? What she found? Hey, look at that. A nice HP banana. Now, is it Mercy will hold that or will the other characters hold it? Because I remember before that I think it was only Guy was the only person who didn't have a HP banana. Where would I see that? Would it be under like... I thought it would be under stuff, but maybe it's under team instead. Let's see. So, Guy Manuel? No... Although it doesn't actually say that any of those guys have a banana either, so... Hmm, interesting. Right, we've reached the end of the screen, and we found it in! Ah, oh, yeah. Well, I think that's it for today, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. We have defeated ten different kinds of monsters found inside of Miitopia, and we've also raised our warrior to level five. That's another medal for us! Oh, wait, we got the cleric to level five. Wait, have we just gotten every hero to level five now? There's the thief. Oh, no, I think it's only... There's only one that hasn't, isn't it? Oh, no, they all are level five. Dude, how many medals at once do you want to give us? Any more? No, no more. So, like I said, that's it for today, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. In the next episode, I think we need to explore a little bit more of this cave to return the final face to Greenhorn, and then we can finally go ahead and make passage past Bowser Jr. At least that's my guess. I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye.